again. Hi, I'm Owen Reese. Uh, I'm Director of Creative Management over at uh, MediaMath. All right, that's, that's a good one, how I got involved with Scala. Um, so I was working at a company, uh, and we were actually doing a lot of C++, uh, and our clients wanted us to move to .NET. And F Sharp was still a research language at Microsoft, but being uh, an ML offshoot, uh, of course, I was naturally attracted. Uh, but when they told us we had to go uh, to the JVM, I looked for a language that was uh, similar. And I found Scala, and I started attending the Boston Scala meetup groups. Um, and after a while, uh, you know, I wanted to, to just join a company because I figured, you know, after a year and a half of, of just sort of being a language lurker, it was uh, time for me to take the plunge. So I did. Uh, about nearly six years ago, I, I you know, joined a company and, and did Scala full time and uh, you know, I hadn't really looked back since. You know, uh, that's, that's funny, um, an ideal stack, I don't really have one. Uh, I mean, my ideal stack is the one that's most productive for, uh, for the developers. So I think right now, uh, that stack uh, is just a small enough amount that's similar enough that people can transition between the different roles, so, uh, or different applications that are being built. Uh, you know, I'm looking at Scala, we look at Go, uh, we look at JavaScript, uh, and I think there's a lot of, a lot of interest in, in those three languages, and uh, Python as well for, for sort of glue and, and scripting and, and a lot of the other uh, uh, things that we've been building like AWS Lambdas. And so, you know, these, these languages all have uh, similarities. They all have functions as first class citizens and things of that nature, but there's enough flexibility and enough uh, variety there to keep people entertained. Um, and, you know, uh, talking about an ideal versus actual, you know, uh, I, think, I think I'd be happy uh, Working with almost anything, which is which is odd to hear at a Scala conference, but uh, you know, at home, uh, you know, I, I hack on Scala, and that's that's the language for me. But I don't want to I don't want to force you know my preferences on on other people. All right, so I mean, every conference that Miles Saban's at, you know, I look forward to a talk there, but. I will say, uh, Rob Norris, uh, when he gives a doobie talk, uh, you know, my compliments to the man. He's able to take uh, a concept uh, that might be difficult or might seem inapproachable because it has some sort of scary signature and, uh, and make it very approachable. And that's, you know, that's uh, something I'd like to strive to do. Uh, and uh, so, uh, he said he's improved uh, this talk further. I, I saw a version before at Scala Up North, and uh, so uh, uh, I'm very much uh, looking forward to, to that talk again.